Um, welcome to uh, Shea Bosman, a very boutique little restaurant here at Grand Roche. Um, we have three tables this afternoon. Um, I'm going to explain to each separately, and you do the table and move on. The, um, the first table is some important regular guests of ours, a business meeting. They ordered spring loin, which is finished with some red wine jus, some mushrooms. They asked for red wine, and I suspect you have to decant it. And you have six minutes to do that table. It's right over here, and this is on the left hand side. Thank right. you. And then I just do that table, and then you'll explain the I, other one. And I'll explain the second one to you. Perfect. Spring buck loin with red wine jus, red wine a bit of demi glass, and a bit of mushrooms. Okay. Good. Okay, good luck. <laughs> Good afternoon, gentlemen. How are you today? Very nice. And what? I'm the writer, and he's my amiga, and my guest. Wonderful. And we would like to drink a red wine. Certainly. Would you have a preference for? There's quite a few things that would be nice with uh, the Springbok. Um, yes. I don't know if you have preferences. I'd have three suggestions for you. you know, uh, it can be the most expensive. The most expensive. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Thank okay. You. I'll be right back with that. Thank you. Lowens River Valley Morgenster 2006. Okay. It's a lovely assemblage of uh, red grapes, Merlot based with Cabernet Sauvignon, Cabernet Franc, and um, uh, Merlot from the Stellenbosch region. A very famous producer in a very good vintage. It's quite full uh, with solid tannins, so if you don't mind, I'll go ahead and uh, decant that for you. I might even have a little bit of deposit. Thank you. Right. <coughs> Now, are you familiar with South African wines at all? Yes, this is my first visit in South Africa, and um, but I remember Morgenstern. This is the basic label, and Morgenstern has a more expensive label. Yes, um, yes, they do. Unfortunately, I don't. Um, I don't have that one, but this is actually uh, better for drinking right now. Um, it will. Uh, it has sufficient tannin to stand up to if you don't mind the Springbok. Um, ah, yes. done rare Wonderful. it has beautiful tan but it's not as solid or firm as their higher end okay. cuvee which would need a bit more time now because it is still a relatively uh, young vintage um, I will use a carafe with one of the uh, larger bottoms so, because it can take a lot of aeration. I'm still using the candle because, as I said, it might have already have thrown a bit of deposit. We'll see. Better not take any chances. But it will be a beautiful fold to the springbok. The red wine juice and a nice earthiness that will be wonderful yes. with the mushrooms. So, um, best one. It's my first springbok in my life. Really? Yes. Let's see, it's quite a wonderful meat. <coughs> yeah, I might just. The wine is in perfect condition. The carafe has always already been rinsed, so it's ready for service. And there's not barely a touch of deposit. Yeah. 
Would you like to try? Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. Wonderful. Again, I think it's uh, the right one for me. Perfect. Good. I'm glad you agree with it's that. It's the too. right wine for, for our contract. <laughs> yes, it was a good contract. For me, not for him. Take away the cork? No? You and would you like to? Yes? <laughs> and would you like to keep the bottle on the table? Yes, it's a nice bottle because I, I saw also the platter. But later you can mea, explain, explain that. Mea as well. Certainly. Please enjoy the wine, enjoy your meal, and have a wonderful evening with us. Thank you. Thank you.